Hey guys, so today is Sunday. Oh, I've been tasked to, John went through Jelly's clothes, so we gotta get Jelly new summer clothes, because her shorts don't fit, so. I need to buy a hundred things. Mm -hmm. yeah. We usually get our clothes from Old Navy and Target, just because she grows out of them super quickly. And they always have cute stuff. Mm -hmm. right. This shirt that I'm wearing right now is from Old Navy. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, that's what we're gonna do, and more than likely, maybe we'll go to the pool. She wants to go to the pool. She I likes. want to. And yesterday, I went to my cousin's house. I went to, um... I did tell them. Visit, and... Wait, you told them? Mm -hmm. mm, you stole my story. You didn't tell them the good part. Ah, uh, we went to slide, and we went down it, and there was a big pool of water, and we had a water slide. And we had a water fight and we made oobleck. It was fun. Okay, so seatbelt, sit back. Okay, goodbye. Sit on. We'll see you at Old Navy. You like the coral one better? Yeah. I think that'll really be cute on you. We need to get you jean shorts too. And then like shorts to be around the house in, like lounge shorts. Yeah. So, we'll get some jean shorts up in here. Hi, people. I got some jean shorts. Hey, guys. So, um, one so thing about Jelly is that <laughs> she enjoys color. Everything well, color. And girly. This shirt is And like unicorns. This right? shirt. Look at it. Let me put this. This is the shirt. Like nothing can get better. And I also got these sandals. I like these. I think they're cute. Also my favorite color. I got these. This is not my favorite color, but this is. We also got these jeans. Okay, we should do rest at home. But I got this and a bunch more stuff over here. But yeah. <laughs> what? So what? what is that? Are they yummy? Okay, so a few things arrived and I figured I'd show you them. First of all, my piece of bacon, if you guys remember from last week, um, this is the incense holder from Rachel Saunders. Saunders, Saunders. Um, and it's cute, it's so cute. I just don't wanna scratch the wood, but I love it. Then, I picked up these candlestick holders. I don't know if I told you guys about these, but these are from Denmark, and they are the, um, oh, they're the Warkala candlesticks uh, by this, um, I think he's from Finland is the designer, but anyway, these were going for, I don't know, one, what was it, like $180, I think, for a pair that I saw in Teakwood. Now, I found these, which are full of white paint. Looks like somebody painted them, but I got them for $25. And they are, all I gotta do is strip the paint. I'm gonna buy a paint stripper, and then just sand them really nicely, because the wood still looks intact. It's just this, they're cracking a little bit, but I think it's the, um, I think it's the paint. I just love, this design and the shape and I'm so happy that I was able to find them for $25 for your home is pretty cool. This ties in with the whole mid-century modern theme that I've got going on and two, I appreciate the the designer of these and three, they just need a little TLC. I don't know where I'm going to put them yet, but anyway. Now something new that I got and I wanted this so bad is my no Gucci lamp. It is so freaking cute. Let me turn it on. I was able to snag mine off of Toto Kalo, and I believe I got it for $105, which might seem a little bit ridiculous to some people, but I really, really wanted this lantern light. And I will leave the, um, the style, because they have different shapes. This one, I believe it's one of the smaller table lamps. I'm waiting to get the table, which should get here the little end table that I purchased. Um, it should get here on Wednesday.
I have some downtime at work and need to organize our drawers. Um, we work at remote locations sometimes and this is where all of our supplies go. And I just redid this entire drawer system. For those of you that don't know, I work in GYN Oncology. <clears throat> so we have things like biopsy jars, because we do a lot of those. Lube, obviously, silver nitrate. Um, sutures, pipels for endometrial biopsies that we do. Extra supplies, blood drying supplies, needles, things like that. Um, and that all lives in here. So I'm going to do exactly what I did on this side to this bad boy and get rid of any expired needles or biopsy punches uh, that we uh, we don't we don't need. <laughs> So these are the instruments we use on a daily basis. Uh, this is called a tenaculum. This is a needle driver, a clamp, ring forceps, um, scissors, long GYN scissors. There's another sound in here. And then a tischler. It all looks so nice. Sweet. Oh guys, it is, I don't even know what today is. Today's Wednesday the 26th of June and I am in my bed. It is 10.15 at night. Um, today, I mean, I was at work. I left to work early. So today has been an admin day as far as just getting things done. Um, I, like I said, I've been working on this side project for a couple of months now and I'm trying to get things in order things delivered, things ready for the launch of Project O, that's what I'm calling it. Uh, as you all know, I went to New York for the shoot and it went well, I got the photos back, they look great. And I'm just sitting here editing everything, sending out some important emails, trying to get everything squared away. And once I have a launch date and all that good stuff obviously I will let you guys know and I'm like editing on my lunch break and taking calls I really quickly wanted to show you I got the side table in for the bedroom here I can show you guys and these photo frames are still here I need to get photos for them um oh should I turn this off hold on let me see if it'll so there is the table so cute and i'm sorry i'm blinding you guys with this um with the lamp i have the lamp on i'm working in my room tonight there we go so there is the side table i love it i'm so happy with it i love the legs on it i just love the shape of it my noguchi light is on there as well as this little vase that i have to find something to put uh, i don't know i have i haven't gone to the store yet um and then my bacon guys leave you guys here i need to get back to work <laughs> i need to get back to work night okay so when i out throw it i'll throw it away did you uh um do more of the puzzle mm-hmm yeah more of the tiger stuff i got some more of their tiger down hey guys it is Friday. <laughs> I feel like I've been absent um, from the vlogs. I haven't turned the camera on, really. And then tomorrow's my Bad Bunny concert. Or not my Bad Bunny concert, but I'm gonna go see Bad Bunny and Anuel. Hi, look, a hot freaking mess. Okay, I feel like I only talk to you guys when I'm about to get to bed. I have been doing some like, I don't know, I feel like I wanna spruce some things up with like my beauty routine. I watched Alana and she just recently did like a get ready with me. And she was using some Vici, I think it was a Vici, oh, what is it called? 
I don't remember. I'll put it here too. Something 89, but it's some type of hyaluronic acid. Um, and she says it's a really, really good primer. Her skin looked amazing. And Katie Jane Hughes always uses Rodile, the eye sculpt around her mouth. And it just makes her, like, I really like that lived in lipstick look. Uh, or I'll just use, I've been wearing this crap out of Glossier's Leo lipstick. And I just smudge it around because I like that look. I, I don't know, I feel like it sculpts the lips and it just makes it look a lot. I like a matte lip. I don't know, I feel like I haven't really been um, with it when it comes to like the makeup launches and all that stuff. I haven't been to a Sephora in so long. Ooh, maybe we'll go to Sephora. I do wanna get brow gel in a lighter color. My hair, like I don't dye my hair, it's naturally this color and it's like a light brown it looks black on camera and it looks black but in person it's not it's a light brown but my eyebrows are like pube hairs they make noise when you rub them together um but they're thick as shit they are super coarse and just, just they look like pube hairs on my face so i need something to lighten them and i don't necessarily want to dye them hold please i don't miss that Okay, mira esto. We're gonna look at this. They're so thick and unruly. Look at the type of brush that I had to get to brush them. And I don't even think that this is an eyebrow brush. This is to scrub some shit in <laughs> your kitchen. Like your kitchen sink or something. So I went to the Muji store when I was in New York and I saw this out of the corner of my eye and I touched it. And I'm like, I mean, it's not like the softest of brushes, but to brush these eyebrows like this is the best thing ever especially mine because they're so thick and unruly and spoolies like they just don't hold up really well but this brush like it's so good and it just brushes them it makes them nice and fluffy it separates them so kudos to this kitchen brush that i bought at muji for like i don't know three four dollars so I want to get a lighter brow gel to help with my pube ass eyebrows. Um, yeah. Yeah, I want to go to Sephora tomorrow. I wonder if I could squeeze that in too. Let's see. Pube hairs. Ooh, <laughs> that's scary. Okay. Just left the bank. I'm on my way to do like run some do some admin stuff. Um, just got off the phone with my lawyer. Like so, <laughs> uh, being a big girl is fucking scary. But at the same time, it's exhilarating. It feels great. You just want to make sure that you're doing everything legally, correctly, so that I also don't break the law and have the IRS coming for me. I'm changed, bathed. In comfy clothes and just a jean and jeans and tee. What does one wear to concerts? I don't know. Like, I really don't. I am so hot and sweaty and bothered. Like, if I could just go naked, I'd go naked. But, um, I'm parked. I'm just waiting for my coworkers to get here because we're meeting up at her um, family's house and then we're just heading to the venue. Put some makeup on. I'm not really crazy about it because I feel like it's just gonna melt off of my face um, And I forgot to put on mascara And I was listening to all my bad bunny songs Favorite. <laughs> it was uh, 4th of July when I thought of. That's what I think it is. Because it has the red, white, and blue. 
maybe radical one of his most beautiful things. This one I like a lot. The next one is. It's over here. So, this is the next one. Okay. Um, I have this one. It's a rainbow tie dye shirt. So far, it's my favorite one. I love rainbows. Now I'm wearing this rainbow metallic flamingo with the beige background with these red, really, 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 really soft shorts. Put, I say, cousins of these. Just in a different color. Now I'm wearing a galaxy ballerina shirt with a leg. <laughs> <laughs> This coral daisy um, shirt with uh, these stroke red shirts for the song. I think this kind of nasty. I have no more, so I'll see you next time.